well, well, well. Happy New Year. It's Wes and Aaron driving around in the US 105 Cruiser. Um, golly, 18 degrees when I got in the car this morning. A frosty start to the new year for sure. Um, but we thought we would uh, catch back up with y'all because there is another change in the traffic configuration going over I-35 in Temple. And while I will do my best not to make left turns where they are not permitted, uh, we will try to go over the bridge and hopefully, uh, since it's like the first time I've driven over it, I won't miss any stop signs or any other uh, things that uh, are part of the rules of the road, but uh, no guarantees. I will do my best. So, um, the uh, Adams Bridge and then, Aaron, do they call it the Central Bridge? Is that the other the other one that, yes. that we're both going over there? Okay, so now, um, the what was the Central Bridge has been opened back up and the Adams uh, overpass is now closed to traffic, so they'll be making some adjustments there. Is that scheduled to come down altogether? I believe so. Uh, that's going to come down and we're just going to have these level bridges across. So it won't be the arc bridges, they'll just be the... I believe that's the plan. Nice draw bridges that go straight across. Cool. All right. So when you come down off of um, uh, West Adams and you're going over, um, it's a little different to get on I-35 than, of course, going over the highway is a little different as well. But straight on here uh, for about the last, oh, has it been six months that we were going over this bridge? Uh, it's been changed. So now you can see the orange barrels, the uh, Christmas tree of Texas, um, standing up here, and you no longer go over, you go straight. So a lot of people would head this way when they wanted to get on 35 and, and go south, uh, but now you've got a couple of different options. You can get on to I-35 and head south, or you can keep going over the bridge. Again, the Adams Bridge is now closed, and the Central Bridge has been uh, reopened, the brand new one that we're gonna be going over here. So you wanna keep an eye out as you cross over the new traffic pattern. And there's no stop sign for you here. These lights will go up eventually, but they do have a stop sign to your left here as you go through this intersection. And now we're crossing over the brand new bridge and heading uh, into towards downtown Temple, I should say. And so if we look over there, I can see they're taking down portions of yep, that Yep, they're uh, ripping it up bridge. already. So that's, that's going to be down. coming down. I can't wait to see how all this is going to look when they're done with it. Uh, obviously, so much of it is torn up right now. But uh, then when you come up off of uh, the new overpass for I-35, they want you to stay straight here. They don't want you turning left. And as the signs <laughs> indicate, in the left lane, stay straight. So do not turn right from this lane. You need to go down and then loop around and come on back Oh. No left turns, no right turns. As these signs say right here, which I completely missed six months ago, so <laughs> I've gotten used to looking at them. So. You know, it's, it was actually, I think it was May 2nd. Was when it we, May? Oh, when Lord. we filmed that first video where we had to go over the old uh, airport. No, no, it wasn't airport. Yeah, the air, airport road bridge. <clears throat> That's the when one it, When they turned that, there. that one that was formerly one way, they turned that two way. Yes. I remember the first time we went over that and then we ended up over here so so something to get used to if you're uh, coming in from Belton and going into downtown Temple there are new bridges in play getting you over I-35 and we're just gonna loop around real quick and we'll show you the way back over which is a little bit different now too okay, it's kind of poking out now you Big can reason turn. why they don't want you turning left because <laughs> you'll get stuck in that intersection and start blocking traffic yeah. but, man may I can't believe it's been that long but they did say that they would be working on these things until Christmas of 18, so. But when you want to go back over the bridge. <laughs> and pardon me, I meant this Adams Bridge over here. That's the one that was just one way for the longest time where it kind of split between uh, Adams and airport for years. And they opened that up for two way and that's what happened in May. Cause you had to kind of wind around to end up over at the intersection by uh, McDonald's and KFC. And now, it's just kind of a straight shot from West Adams. So you've got a lane closure here, so be on the lookout for that. So it used to be you go right <clears throat> past the McDonald's in order to uh, get yourself over the bridge again. Well now, the cones and barrels are up, 
and you need to go straight here, almost as if you were gonna take the ramp down to Starbucks, but that has all been opened up now. As you can see, if you wanna take a down to the frontage road, you would stay to the right. If you wanna go back over the bridge, you're going through here. And you can see, I don't know if you can hear that horn honking, but there is confusion. <laughs> People who haven't been this way yet, one reason we're making the video. I hope they weren't honking at me. Uh, I think they were honking at the person who believed that they needed to get over to the right, and they just kinda of stopped in the middle of traffic. So eventually these lights will activate and you'll have to mind the traffic signals here and they've got a stop sign over there. And as we cruise back uh, into town here, now it's just like we got off of 35 and uh, are heading uh, <clears throat> through Temple towards Belton again. And this bridge is coming down and- um, Look at that. I mean, it's always a good idea to yield because you never know what's coming out from behind something, but there's no longer anything coming up that road except maybe work trucks. So there it is, new bridges in play in Temple. Drive safe, and uh, if you have uh, any other observations or uh, any other notes, please feel free to put them in in the comments. And uh, Happy New Year, everybody. Thank you for joining us here on uh, the US 105 channel and uh, for checking out uh, our Town Square Media stations.